Hey everyone, so again, na the Sunshine Tournament, this is game 2 versus R2. Uh, you probably watched the first game, so I win, and now it was his time to choose the map. He decided highway to seal. Uh, no, what the fuck, I'm retarded. No, this is, this is, of course, this is Nuclear Winter. What, what I'm saying? Okay, so this is Nuclear Winter, and I decided to play Land Route. Uh, to counter his mechanized deck, uh, because I think I, I think he banned my old crop. So yeah, I, I feel like it was either that or he's trying to mechanize. Uh, yeah. Oh no, oh no, he also banned my he's trying to mechanize. I think so. It was either that I think or or marines. So yeah, yeah, I. I was expecting the game to not be this easy, uh, especially mechanized. But at least I have the speed advantage, and as you can see, this is why I send the um, yeah, Iron 19 and PSU Tiger on the side. Also, an SF in case he tried to send uh, something, and you see he's. What the fuck? He's sending a bomber? Yeah, in all case, I can counter it. I'm playing mostly defensive on, the, on everywhere. I'm mostly hoping that this thing gonna work, and on Delta I'm gonna get get a good control and maybe hope to push with my Jagger 19. Actually, he sent his bomber. I, I don't know why what he was doing. Maybe he threw my KWS was too far away, or I evac'd, but I didn't, and already losing the terrible big. It's a lot of points that's really hard for, for, to him. That's really, really fucking hard for him. Right? I, I don't know how to say it, but like, this opening is it's glorious to me. <laughs> and what is also not glorious is that he didn't smoke while he's. Um, he's a, his unit and he, and I, I lost I with the shot of course the Milan with the shot but that could have been <coughs> sorry that would have been a, a kill on his A um, I should have probably uh, attacked with the the Milan but I didn't now I activate again. Against the the tank, the tank, yeah, of course, the tank. And they miss again, and, and they miss again, of course, of course. Uh, why it? Why it? It's it's not Milan two, it's Milan miss. So once again they miss, which is very good. And on top of it, I didn't place my automatic well, so very very well played, very well played. I kill almost nothing when I could have probably killed his AA and at least damage his tank. And I probably should have killed his infantry if I placed my auto magic better, but and then I'm losing the fight. Which of course is uh, not good at all. Not not good at all. Now he's he he do a, a very good clutch smoke on the Wilk. And and yeah, and yeah he, he get here which really like countering this was my was my plan, so Oh my god! Horrible position! And on top of it, because he killed my. Uh, uh, no, he did. He, I didn't kill his A. My parachute tire can't re engage now. Uh, I, I would love so much to have killed this because now I could probably send the tiger, maybe I kill uh, his infantry in the open field, maybe I. I can force his tank to go back, uh, and if they didn't. The missile tiger. Gonna kill it. At least I have some infantry that will come and try to to stop him from getting the stronghold of the of Delta. I still keep alive my unit, my infantry, for timing. So infantry is not looking great. I had still hope, 
to, to recover this bad situation. Also got vision on, on his trailer. And in his trailer is also creative by the way. So I was thinking mm, maybe maybe I can like get a piece wine. Maybe I can do something. And also he, not not only that but also I, I can even if I don't I keep vision and I know the AA is very far away so a little bit of uh, room for the parachute tiger. That I miss my call, of course, because oh my god, wh why didn't I, I activate the, the rocket pod? Like, what the fuck? I... Fuch Milan, <laughs> Fuch Milan, eating oh, crit, crit, oh, I, I forgot that. That was some good, good Milan. That was some good Milan in. On top of it, the last two is putting the pressure. Mm, yeah, yeah, he's not gonna definitely go back. He's CV up very, very, very early on. And considering I was uh, only fighting for a plus one advantage, I really, really needed to get something done. Like, fast. Or, or else I need to uh, stop the bush and CV up like also very fast almost as fast as, as he do he, his tank approach and I almost get them but no he he pulled back very uh, very wise decision that could have had in disaster for him I decided I had to to stop the pressure, I have to stop the bleed, and now it gets really weird. I have some infantry that ha that need repair. My my last two is out of ammo. Uh, I have a second one, but it's yeah. The first one need ammunition, so that's gonna slow me down even more. And what what everything goes, the season twenty-three just will keep coming in, which isn't good. And on top of it, he he's sitting at a at a plus one tick, no plus two tick, plus two tick. Sorry. At least this bombing run like did very alright, like or even good. Like, oh my god, the the mother shoots and gets. Oh, that was. A Exactly the strike I hope for. I think that's why also the 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 Pashu Tiger survives uh, this attack because oh, I lose one tank also because they the, yeah his his unit couldn't get a clear shot. Premise is not really the do the so much damage. That's just. They do so much damage and they tend to not get uh, panic as easily as my Panzer Grenadier and you see my Panzer Grenadier now dying. That's... yeah, that's not good. Now, now on top of it I, I start to become fire starter. I see him yep, way, 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 way too fast. Something you shouldn't do when you are down in, in ground. You shouldn't do that. I, I should try to put more pressure and, and get back the ground I lost. But instead, I'm playing bad and I fire starter. And this is horrible because when there isn't an ATGM in Delta, in, in in this town, that, that's when you can actually get back in position because there isn't too much problem. So the moment where, where you really can't get back is when there is ATGM and manpad. That's where really you you know it's almost set and done. 
that's gonna be very very hard because not only his mechanized and his infantry will just trim in and stall for an hour or even beat my infantry but on top of it it's a difficult town to to push and it, it's so big that the last two won't really be able to 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 panic everything very probably not even panic the zone where, where they attack because it, it's it's uh, as I said it's it's a town so there wouldn't be much damage and that will suck a lot that really does suck and he has Granatomet on top of it yes you know Granatomet are extremely good against the country he panicked my, my tank before they can even my infantry before they can even fire their RPG. Now they can but it's panic so less precise than usual and they won't get chance to reload. I would have loved to get my Leo 2 pushing him but there is an anti gem and you see he it kills the last one. And now he he, he spams so much of his of his transport to get my recon infantry. And I try so much to make them escape. This, this infantry with only one or two HP are the ultimate value. That's what will keep me to get a, to survive against him. And unfortunately, he's he's doing exactly the good move uh, sending here. So he killed everything, and that's so bad. At least uh, I, I can get some kill, but he lose non-valuable infantry. Okay, I'm about to kill a tank. That's funny, but he, he killed non. I killed non-valuable infantry while he killed elite and shock squad that has like a very expensive price. So. The exchange is really not in my favor. That's why also sometimes the, the 10... I mean not sometimes, but often 10 RPM in forest can... Even with high AP and high precision can really go bad. They can really go bad. And you saw here that if, even when... So, so my elite squad can basically kill any of his transport in one shot because they never miss and they are precise it's not enough because he can just send so many of them that's exactly what happened funny enough I try to do the same with M41A1 in my transport so uh, at least he don't completely push me back of Delta but it's pretty close and you see some unit moving on the side, uh, going into Alpha. So he's basically moving, mo moving the front, rotating the front, and I'm losing a second tank to the ATGM. Oh my god, that was uh, this ATGM was a nightmare. And the attack really... I think I saw it, but... I was thinking he would need more time than... Than that. I was thinking he would regroup and then push, but he actually didn't really regroup, he just push. Instant. And already there is an infantry so close. Which hurt a lot my plan. So I decided, okay, I'm gonna try to push at the same time Delta. Uh, maybe with my artillery I can stall the push long enough. Uh, maybe he forgot his A. Uh, at least I'm gonna get some vision with the PH2 target. And maybe, just 
maybe he will be so focused on trying to bash alpha that maybe his rotation will fail and I will get out of del I will get the upper hand on delta or at least that's what I was hoping for as you can see even through his moving out there is a yeah, there is a, uh, still a lot of infantry. Uh, and <laughs> that's infantry I can't deal with. Still, I, I get the vision on, on his Wilk, so that's cool. That's cool. But I lost it. I think I'm gonna regain the vision. I don't know. <laughs> I'm also losing my leaf garden. So yeah, my, my Reaper Micro, uh, my Infantry Micro wasn't the best here. And also he completely played me around here. Completely played me around. He's currently ahead in Conquest Point, so for the, all this time I, I need to push on Delta. Or maybe push elsewhere, I need to do something. Uh, position wouldn't look that bad actually if I, had, I was ahead in Conquest Point. But considering he's ahead, that's really bad. And for the sixth time, I don't know, I try to push here. I have a lot of infantry, but I have a lot of fire support, but they, they can't get a clear 9 of side every time. Every fucking time I can't. This uh, city just don't want to give me line of sight. A uh, good line of sight to the Mara 2 to the Motor 2 turn getting the kill. Now I think for the first time I get actually good line of sight on Delta and kill a good chunk of infantry. Which really was something I needed a lot. And also his tank get way too close, his, his M2 will get way too close to the Vashamagger and he didn't deal with my peace run any on top of it, so that was the mistake I was really hoping for. We don't have A on, on the side so I will send a peace run. But like that was really the mistake I really needed him to do. Something like that, something that will make him lose so many units. But I can maybe get back into this game. Problem is that he will kill my Fashion Mario 19 anyway. And yes, uh, loss of his tank was not ever his unit, so I need still, <laughs> still to get through all the infantry. The infantry is just. Never ending, and as well as I try to repair, I'm not. I, I was fighting like always on, on his term, and also where his units were are good. Like I fight in forest, in forest now in city, where actually I would like a, a good open field, and now he's sitting at a plus one. So I have to attack on top of it. In other ways you want to, I mean not always, but most of the time you want to be the defender, I do feel. At this level we prefer to, to be defensive. Because it forced me to attack him. I get some position, can kill his uh, man pad. I think I also kill his... Uh, his uh, ATGM. No, oh no, I didn't kill the ATGM. Okay, I didn't kill the ATGM. Actually, but I get vision on them. So, yeah, now they die. I was thinking, okay, we are gonna try something else. We are gonna try to maybe don't stop his uh, his infantry, not kill them, but we are gonna try to get aside 
with the Marauder 2 and stop his reinforcement of, of infantry. Because as you can see, there is like a shit ton of, of them. He sent a, a, an MI 25, for, no, 35, and sadly <coughs> I misplay and send the, the KWS to kill Asneska, which was not necessary. And I'm sorry, I'm my KWS too late, also the PH Tiger too late, so. And that's really. Uh, I was very sad. I could have probably get like. The, the kill with. Uh, my Mara would have done, done so much damage. At least I, I know his uh, Strela is reloading. So. I can get a quick skill, but. The parachute tower is out of snab, so even if I'm killing vehicle, they already dropped the better infantry, so that's not enough. I'm far, I'm far to stop the bleed now. I understand my my idea was almost working, but sadly, just in the nick of time, he was able to kill the the barrel too. And, and stop, stop the bush. Now it's so many, 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 many infantry. Getting a seed, but it's it's not valuable. I, I know you see on top of it, I'm running, almost running out of infantry. And I know Dragoners and Love Garden won't cut it against the never-ending Motor Trutzen. Never ending but the Chutan. And my artillery is, is not enough if I can't stop him from getting in, in the in, in the building. Like if I had the building that that would be okay. That would be okay. But without the building that's just not possible. And considering that you see that I'm just now completely dealing with with uh, the alpha problem. And it stole me for way too much time. I have lost two squad of Fashion Mark 19, and one of them now has 1 HP. And plus one of them has 1 HP, so it's basically like 3 squad dead. Or almost dead. At least I will repair this one, but that will take a long time. And 7 minutes into the game, he has a plus 1. I don't have any way to get the conquest point. And he has a uh, hundred conquest point advantage. I was thinking, oh, now, but I don't have time. Now I was thinking, I don't have time. Like, time is running out for me. You can look also, the fob is half empty. Also, I, I, I regroup my last two so that they can share ammo and, and they both start to reload. This is something that is important. You, you try to before you you repair you, you rearm your unit. Try to get them at at least at least one ammunition. That is very 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 important because then they will start their reload cycle. If if your unit has zero ammunition, when they will get repair, you will have to wait for a reload an entire reload time to to get them back in action. <coughs> So always try to get at least one ammunition left in your unit, and that goes for many units. Uh, missile, uh, like Chaparral, Chaparral, Crotal, uh, LRM, Archery. That goes for a lot of units, so... <coughs> that's a quick micro tips. Sadly, that's really not enough. That's really not enough. I, I'm trying to send my my piece, my tiger, and my piece run, hoping that maybe he will send. I don't know. I, I tank something in penetrant of value and send off infantry. But he's playing. But no, he's. He know he just has to spam infantry. He know it. And and why why he don't like? 
that's on my that's fault on my part to just play like that and give him the fight that he needs that he wants. And at this point I decided okay now it's it's completely done. I am probably losing the game. And and there is very little I can do. Especially the Grand Tomate give me the hint that my infantry, even elites will never get get out of this. And I said okay, I bet I have a lot of of plane. I have plane, I have parachute tiger. I have the control of the sky. Maybe on India he's weaker. Maybe there is hope. Like I, I won't surrender before knowing if it's weak. I'm killing one A on Delta. That's not the most important. I'm sending my plane up here to scout for for the parachute tiger. Or I might have misplay. Actually, I. I I will be honest, I don't know if I actually misplay or if it was great play. Actually, could have been a misplay considering I'm doing, I'm getting so much damage on my tornadoes here. Yeah, yeah. And I know that he didn't have much units except into the, um, the city of in India. So I can't, of course, I can't send my PH Tiger. My Eagle 90 will get here, but and I know that it's probably where his CV is. So this is where I need to put the pressure on. I am also starting to remove, to release the pressure on Delta, trying to just basically gain time, just protect my CV, and we, we will try, we will try to do something on India. I'm trying to soak up missile. Uh, for the parachute tiger, maybe also getting. Now I get vision. I think I'm gonna kill the promet. Yes, uh, that's some very small target. Oh my god, I almost lost an eyesight. That's some very small target, but at least it's a kill. At least it's a kill. And on top of it, it's an AA. So that's. I was thinking, okay, now I now I have to keep the missile. My parachute tiger is here. I've killed the, the promet. Now there's probably nothing, and and no, no, I misplay. I misplay. There was a grum, and the snake goes just not in time. I don't get the kill, and I lost the, the vision on his. Um... <coughs> I think it's Sava. No, it's not Sava. No, Sava is what? Is it? I lost vision on his uh, Strela. I just visited on this trailer. But you, you do see that his CV is here. It must be his CV with 5 HP here. And on top of it, he has very, very little units. And when I say very little, but like my Jagger Knight in literally run here. So there is still hope. But I need to protect my CV on my two pointer. Oh, oh, oh no, on Delta. So that's where the CV de combat gonna be used. He tried to stop me with uh, his his helicopter. I sent the peace train. Sadly, I lose vision. I don't know how I lose vision. Maybe the Jaeger 19 couldn't see it. Sending a new PH tiger. I need to get here very fast. I, I can't wait. Basically, I need some like helicopter or plane. I need unit that will get there fast. That's also why my units are all fast moving without any precaution. Last two trying to delay on, on Delta. I know I'm gonna lose the CV on Delta now. I'm sure. I'm not sure I will lose it. So automatic die, but it kill it kill his um, his helicopter, which was the most important thing actually. I will not really need much more AA with the the parachute tiger incoming. Uh, it has its own AA, and my when my player will get back into action, they will be able to play this role as well. Now the only thing that's important is sending the Leo 2 to get the till. I wanted to send some Jaeger 19 in length because they are fast to get more vision and so the the power of shock squad of uh, no, elite squad. 
But I can't, I can't, so I'm using my million two that is supposed to defend the position as a, an infantry uh, an infantry attacking unit. That's um, good shit. I almost g get the, the fire on his, uh, on his command unit, but he, he play well, he play well, he moved back. He's trying to win as much time as he can. I have killed his unit. His punter. I don't know. His fifth squad. I don't know the name, but I've killed it. So I know there's almost nothing that can stop him. Except that CV de combat, of course, CV de combat. This is the shock, uh, shock command squad. So they kill it, but they, they don't have uh, RPGs. So now. Uh, good luck, good luck against uh, the tank. His seed uh, don't do much. I will send my own seed to counter his own seed. That's some funny uh, gameplay. Not gonna lie. His CV is dead, so I'm at plus two. Trying to stop his uh, Saria. Uh, yeah, the, the tornado is here. Didn't really do a good job of it. At least the tiger get, get the kill, so I know now that he will probably not get any CV on India. I use uh, le commandant de combat. Commandant de combat. But it's not working. It's not working. Against so much infantry, it's panic and now it's lost. But I, I think for the time. I did a good job. I even sent the peace rhine trying to gun run. But I think I did a pretty good ta good job at making it surviving. And the push, the last hope push on India, working wonder. I was thinking about sending a new CV on Delta, but I actually forgot and, and I realized, okay, no, I have a recent CV on India. I just need my CV on India to survive. Um, I'm also sending my Pikachu Tiger to at his base. Uh, why? Because simply, with seven minutes on the line, there's almost no reason to send him home. Because if I send him home to the fob and he reload, the, the, the time that it will take, the game will be end. The game will end, basically. But by the time it happened, so I don't uh, need that. I, j I wanted to kill his uh, artillery instead that could maybe theoretically kill one of my CV which will actually determine the, the outcome of the game if it happened or not necessarily but that would, would really suck like you see it's he's aiming against my foo 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 now trying to push again on alpha with his tank got a side shot on his unit that suck a lot like a lot. The the fufu finally get here. I'm at plus one at this rate. I'm actually um, with plus one. I will not win the game, but I will. Pro it would have been a draw. Also same water. Uh, but at plus three, he definitely lose the game if he don't do anything. And that's where like I'm thinking about Alpha. Maybe I need to send something on Alpha to stop him. I need you need to stop him on Alpha. I also need him to recapture India. That's why I have a tank and automatic. Normally that, that would be enough to counter what you can send. He even lose his ISF, so he has no counter against my Tiger, uh, and I can safely cross the water. And I'm thinking, mm, so now I can even maybe get the kill on Delta because it's it's funny, funny stealth tank. No, funny stealth helicopter. -y. And I spot the CV. And I spot the CV and everything. Plane is coming. Petri Tiger missile is coming. I miss, but the second one probably would not have missed. And there was a beast right behind it. So that's probably the last of his. CV and 
yeah, comeback is happening. That was probably pretty insane that I pulled out. But I was really bad in the first place. Like, no offense to Zartu, but I think it's mostly me just being bad. He also played pretty well to certain extent. Like, when he push again, when right, he push on Alpha, like, the execution wasn't good. He lost two tanks for nothing. But the idea of pushing on Alpha to stop me from building up my push on, on Delta was pretty good. And after that, I took so much, so much, so much time. I couldn't push on Delta. My plan in the beginning of the game has been completely thrown off. I never really get control of Delta. And the, la the, la the last thing I did on Delta that was the only thing that really, really worked well was the, in the last second of the game when the PSU tire come and get the CV. But it was mostly like the comeback and the push on India. Okay, we were gonna see the kill list. It was mostly the push on India that really breaks the game. He has so little unit. I think he has like one ATGM, one man pad, and two fist squad. Like, not even recon, I do believe. I don't think he has even recon unit. And no tanks. And no big AA. So, like, that was so little defense. And I think we can see that my PSU tire got quite a good number of kill. And I think, yeah, that was mostly plain PSU Tiger, funny, funny plane. Also, the Mara 2 getting a lot of kill. <laughs> Look at this one, he got two key, two tank kill. I know it's not the best tank ever, also this automatic. I know it's only 40 points, but still. Mara 2 is only 40 points, also. <laughs> yeah, good unit, good unit. And. Yes, I, I think at the end of the day, that India push was good. So, after that, that was 2 0 against R2. And I couldn't enter into the quarter final. So, yeah, I don't think there will be much more interesting thing in, in this uh, kill list. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, there is not, not much thing interesting. So yeah, the, the, the next game will be against Seo Yoon, and hope to see you in this one.